Hello everyone, and welcome back to Farming Simulator 15. It looks like we have already mowed, so it is time to windrow. Um, I think we're working on, yeah, just getting grass for our cows. We don't have a baler yet, unfortunately, uh, and we're probably not going to anytime soon due to their expense. Um, excitingly, we are less, or about a month and a half away from FS17. Um, is this doing it? Yeah, it's going. Oh, I love Windrowing. It's the best. Anyway, yeah, we're like a month and a half away from 17. Um, I've been doing some dev blogs on the channel um, based on Giants dev blogs, which I guess are only on Facebook, which is weird. Like, I can't find them You'd think they'd be on the Farming Simulator site, um, and if they are, they're very buried, or they were the last time I checked, which would have been like a week or two ago. Um, I couldn't find them on the site. I can only find them on their Facebook page, which is bizarre, uh, why they wouldn't put them on both. But anyway, they've been writing dev blogs every couple weeks. They have one on, uh, th their last one was on trains, and they've also had them on animals and other, I've already talked, talked about them all, so... I don't want to go into it, but but a few days ago they did release one on trains, um, where um, instead of just being able to dump off crops and hitting a lever, you will actually be able to use trains as a vehicle yourself to haul stuff around the map. Um, so it'll be part of your like tabbed uh, vehicle list, and you'll actually be able to drive it up and down the tracks, um, both lumber and uh, just produce. So. It'll be interesting, we'll see if it's worth doing that at all. Um, I guess if the map is really huge, that's that would be a really nice addition. Uh, I don't, it'll be interesting. They're adding a lot of really cool new stuff this time around. Um, it seems like it's going to be a pretty big update, pretty big installment, so really looking forward to it. Um, again, that's I think that's October 25th, uh, but don't quote me on that date, but I, I I think, I think that's it. I should have it memorized by now, but, but I don't, so there we go. All right, we've got about probably one more pass here. I'm not really being the most efficient in my wind rowing, but oh well. We'll be able to easily fill up a trailer. Um, how much is the baler? Oops. If I want to buy one right now, let's see, that would be, and yeah, we could buy this one. And then we'd still need a mixer. So yeah, we couldn't do it. That's okay. We'll keep waiting. One of these days, we're going to go to Field 31, our little uh, man-made forest, and we're going to cut all that down and make a ton of money. In fact, I might do that like next episode. Just take a little break from uh, crops. I might do that. We'll see. I also might not. Never really know. Anyway. Let's go put this away and get our loading wagon so that we can get these cows up to 80% instead of a measly 44, which they're at now, productivity-wise. So one of my friends linked, uh, linked me an article, because obviously he knows I play this game a lot. Um, apparent, okay, so in FS17, they're going to have pigs, uh, and pig, there's no, like, sellable byproduct, like, yes, they'll produce manure, but you can't, like, sell that, uh, is what I mean by that. Um, so basically for pigs, just like real life, you breed them, multiply them, and then sell them for the meat. Um, and my friend linked me an article, I didn't even really read it, because, I don't know, I didn't care, I don't know. It was probably good, but I just saw the headline and thought it was ridiculous and laughed and went on my went on my merry way. Um, so I really shouldn't even be talking about it that much without reading it, but whatever. It was basically an article about how PETA uh, said that Farming, simula farming Simulator 17, if they're going to have pigs, uh, they should show the brutal slaughter of the animals uh, as part of the game uh, if, if they're going to have meat, like if, if, if pigs are going to be sellable for their meat, then they should be depicting 
how gruesome it is and all that. And I thought that was a funny thing, just because, you know, PETA... Uh, it's a bit ridiculous sometimes. A little overzealous, I think, once in a while. Um, kind of uh, overzealous and violent and, and bizarre. Plus the fact that they're based in America, right? And Giants is a German developer, I think. I'm, I'm kind of just thinking off the top of my head. I don't actually know if all this that I'm saying is true. Because um, I'm not, like, reporting news right now. I'm just, like, talking. So if I'm wrong, you know, you can tell me. That's okay. I'm good with that. I like to know when I'm wrong. But yeah, anyway. I thought that was funny. That's all. I should probably actually read that article. It, it's probably more ridiculous than just the headline. Um, but and, and, if, and if they did show that, more power to giants. Make it part of the simulation. The better I slaughter and butcher, the, the more money I make. There you go. FS19. There's your addition. There's an idea for free there, giants. Take it to the bank. Oh, we are full. All right. I think we're going to load this off right up here, since we have a nice little uh, trough in the back here. And then I can speed up time until the morning. Oh, OK. Well, there we go. And we'll just let them have as much as they can take, which is probably a lot, because I bought a few cows a time or two ago, I think. And I guess they're taking all of it. Okay, well. Uh, I guess we'll just finish picking it up. Make a little Yui here. Wow, I'm impressed that that took all 21,000 uh, leaders there. Alright, let's drop this down. And there we go. So yep, it's fall. Well, I mean, not technically. But it's starting to feel like fall here in Nebraska. Um, it, it started to feel like that a few weeks ago, and then it got super hot again, for a, hot and humid for a while. Uh, but the last few days have been like kind of rainy. Today's, it's sunny and bright, but it's like you know, breezy and a little cool. Took a little walk this morning, a little morning constitutional. Uh, it was super pleasant, so I'm excited. Hopefully it doesn't go back to crazy hot and humid, because it's been crazy hot and humid far too long here. Uh, I feel like it's been crazy hot and humid since, like, middle of March, instead of just, like, middle of June, like it usually does. Um, but we'll see. Uh, but with fall, um, I don't know if anyone follows me on Twitter, I sent out a complainy whiny tweet earlier about my allergies earlier this week because holy cow if you're wondering why there weren't any videos it's because my allergies were insane this year I mean they knocked me down for a long time and usually Zyrtec will like take the edge off and it's really great uh, it, it helped but it did not did not do the full trick like it usually does so I was just out of commission this week as far as my voice and uh, head congestion was concerned. But it's a little better today. I switched to Allegra. Seems to do the trick. Uh, whatever I got a little better. So yeah, we're back. This week should be a regular uh, onslaught of videos. So how much silage do we have? Not much. Oh gosh. Uh, what we should do is empty this. And then I... Th Did we plant corn? I don't even remember what we have planted. Okay, let's... Let's check our greenhouses, too. Oops, I need that. Okay, that's fine. This should be fine. Okay, let's let's skip time. Let's get to morning. Beautiful. 7 o'clock. Uh, we'll dump this because we need it for silage. Alright, we can just dump the rest out. Yeah, let's empty the silage, and then we can at least put more chaff in there when we have it. Um, if we do some more corn, we'll probably just turn it all into silage here, since we'll need a lot when we get a baler. I didn't realize we were that low. Oh gosh, it's doing the thing where... Oh, okay, hopefully this gets fixed in 17 as well. <clears throat> uh, basically, if you look in the top left, you'll see that I have four pieces of silage, um, and that is enough to count. 
so that I can't actually fill this up with anymore until I find those four pieces. They need a little button that like like a clean silage button or, or somehow to like sweep it out um, without having to like go back and forth like this. So this is going to be really annoying for a while but basically I just have to drive um, kind of like this until that fill level goes to zero. So Giants, if it's not too late, put in a clean silo button in uh, the next installment because this is ridiculous. Okay, let's go dump this out before I waste it. And then I'll go back and try to find that that little piece. Or let us be able to fill it up when it's at, like... Is this even... I can't even get a good camera angle. Okay, well, it's gone. So hopefully I went in the trough there. I didn't couldn't get a good camera angle. It's kind of one of the downsides of this barn. All right, let's find this guy. Oh, this is so bad. It's like either let us like empty the silo with a button or let us fill up the silo when it's at 1% or less. But nope, we have to find those four pieces. Oh gosh. Okay. Well, I may I'm going to take one more pass through and then we'll probably just hope that on the next time we load up the game maybe it'll like fix itself somehow I don't know okay so this is down to scoop this should be fine come on just find it well that's a bummer that that may make this silo completely unusable if I can't find that <clears throat> excuse me, if I can't find those four pieces I literally can't use that uh, which is just kind of ridiculous but we'll we'll see, maybe off camera I'll uh, try to just find that real quick after I'm done with this episode alright, let's take this back and then see what our crops are doing get out of my way water tank that out of there. Alright, let's check on our crops. We have a nice little map for that, that I rarely use. Um, oh gosh, do we not have any... We don't have anything planted here. And what is going on with 20? What have I done? Okay, let's go look. Oh, I think we did corn, didn't we? I think we had corn here. Yep, and then I, uh... Wait, what? Oh, we just missed some. Oh, well. Cultivator will get that. So we need to recultivate this and get some corn planted. Might be worth buying a new corn sower. Because we have this guy, right? Which is 4.5 meters. And we can buy this guy. No, we can't. Gosh, that's so expensive. No, oh, okay, not worth it. That is a lot of money. I am very curious as to what's going on over here. Oh, yeah, we have... Is this canola? I don't remember. Okay, so I actually need to probably go get my harvester. Alright, so let's start um, cultivating this field. Let's get that harvesting. Because I really need this corn to get some more silage. And then I think we can just focus on forestry and just make a ton of money from uh, f cutting down our, our little uh, man-made forest. So let's see, cultivator would be this guy. work. 
Oh, beautiful. Okay, I had someone say... Okay, so last time I tried this plow... Where's my little tractor? Um, wait. No, that's not what I wanted. I want this gone. Okay, so I tried this plow on these bushes. Someone said maybe if I hit create field, it'll get rid of them. So I hit this. Okay. So let's set this up. Alright, moment of truth. We're gonna lower it. Make sure we're like here-ish. And then allow create fields. Come on, bush, go away. Oh no, it didn't work. Okay, let's try it one more time. Um, yeah, I think we can decidedly say that can't get rid of this bush. Nope. Okay. Well. Oh well. Let's lift it up. We tried. Now we just have some dirt, which is not a problem. Uh, we'll dump this off here again. Oh man. I really was hoping that would be, uh, be gone. Alright. I think we can get this guy going on corn duty. You know what we could do? I keep getting yelled at. I mean, not really. But some people get really annoyed that I never fill this up. So here we go. I'll fill it up this time. Either way, I have to pay for it, but... I just don't do this because it takes time that I usually don't want to spend. But that's okay. Let's do it once, just for fun. Show people that I, uh, I do know how to play this game. Kind of. Even if it doesn't look like it. Which I know it does. A lot quite often. Um, but yeah. There we go. Our our cedar is full. Now we can plant some delicious corn while this, uh, while Willy. So we actually need two worker willies. There we go. Um, what else do we need to do? Ah, uh, look at all these trees. So yeah, in a time or two, we are going to just go to town, and we're just going to go around and just, oh, it's going to be amazing. I think we'll, oh, I'm so excited. It's going to take forever, but we're just going to cut them all down and haul them all at once, and it's going to be ridiculous. Uh, I hate this. I hate that I couldn't figure out how to plant them. Sometimes I just planted them like this, but that's okay. Now we have two trees. All right. Um, we need this harvester. No, wait, that's our corn header. Wait. So we need this just... We're just gonna put this in our little potato storage. We have all this room. Don't really need it. Okay, I really need you to, to get off there. Anyway, there we go. And then we can go get our grain header. Oh, gosh. I put that in the worst spot ever. Okay, get out of my way. No problem. I love NFL halftime, like how short it is compared to NCAA. I feel like NCAA, I can record an episode, go through editing, start rendering, and then it's finally third quarter. NFL, I, can, I can't even finish. I get halfway through recording and it's already third quarter. It's amazing. I love it got the Packers and Jaguars on right now. I have no interest in either of those teams. It's just fun to watch. Lions are on in like an hour and a half. But I'm going to record the Parlor podcast today because we couldn't do it yesterday. Still talking about Mr. Robots. Oh, we got our website up too, theparlorpodcast.com. I'll probably put a link in the description um, if you want to check out the television podcast they do with my friend Dean. Okay, so is this canola? Enable straw swath. Let's see real quick. I don't actually know. I need to unfold it. Okay, enable straw swath. Unfold. Let's see what we got. It might be barley. No, it's canola. Okay. Good to know. Alright. 
we'll save that for next time. We'll also make sure we remember to start these guys up next time. And I'll see if I can find oh, this, uh, I'll see if off camera I can find this little bit of silage that we really need to get rid of. We also need to fill up uh, our greenhouses. But again, that'll be for next time. That will take it, take it? Well, I have no idea where I was going with that sentence. Uh, that will do it for this day on the farm. Thanks so much for joining me. Have yourselves a very nice day.